this is max 6675 thermocouple module we have the ground pin we have a vcc we have SCK that is the clock pin and the, we have CS that is the chip select and the last one is SO that is the data out pin okay and we have the two terminals over here as you can see the positive and the negative okay this is the positive thermocouple lid and this is the negative thermocouple lid okay so we'll see the K type thermocouple this is the K type thermocouple and we have a two lid over here so we have to connect the positive to the positive and the negative to the negative so we will connect that ok so now we have connected the terminals over here and the led ok and this is the sensor the actual part which sends ok now we will connect this to the arduino so first we will see some basic information about max 667 and the k type thermocouple module ok this is max 6675 thermocouple temperature module and it is a digital converter which has a range of 0 degree celsius up to 1024 degree celsius right and this is the range when it is paired with a suitable k type thermocouple and this is what the thermocouple look like you can see over here we have a two pins or two terminal over here two wires you can say so the internal circuit as you can say is something like this we have a two junction over here and we have a two different type of metal wire as you can see wire type a and wire type b so when these two wires are welded together at a point so this is called as hot junction and when one of the thermocouple wire is connected to the copper wire of an instrument as you can see this this is formed a cold junction over here you can see now the working of this module is something like this okay so when the junction over here is heated or cooled a voltage is created as you can see over here when it is heated a voltage is created over here as you can see over here millivolts and that voltage can be correlated back to the temperature right so this is how the thermocouple look like and the internal circuit or diagram you can say so with the Arduino we have to make this connection we'll see the result on the 16 by 2 LCD and uh, here I'm using I2C module over here okay so we have to connect the positive terminal as you can see positive wire to the positive terminal and the negative wire to the negative terminal so after making the connection we have to write the code for the same so we'll open the Arduino IDE after opening the Arduino IDE go to sketch and click on the include library over here and click on the manage libraries okay you can use this library or this code I will put this code in the description box you can go and check it out okay so first we'll see with the help of library we'll use we'll write over here max 6675 okay now you have to install this library okay as you can see max 6675 library I have already installed this okay now you can find the code over here go to files go to examples and search for the library okay max 6675 as you can see and we have two codes over here you can also use that code or you can use this code okay first thing you should change is this address over here this address is nothing but the i2c address mine is 0 cross 27 you you can check your i2c address okay so you just have to compile this now after compilation you have to upload this code right okay so we'll upload this code and we'll see the result on the lcd and on the hardware now as you can see we have connected the LCD and the thermocouple module with the Arduino and we have a candle over here and right now the temperature is 29 as you can see so we'll just heat this and we'll see the result on this LCD right as you can see the temperature is getting increased now it's 42 45 is getting increased very rapidly so this is how you connect the thermocouple sensor with the Arduino. 
okay we'll meet in the next video for now bye bye